Hello. In this video we're going to talk about a context diagram. A context diagram is something that you do as part of the design stage of your project and it is actually a type of data flow diagram. It is called a level zero data flow diagram. And so in the middle we have the system represented by one circle, the entirety of the system. And it has that in common with the use case diagram where it has a system within the boundary. Well that circle in the middle represents the whole system. And these um, rectangles at the outside, they are representing entities. They might be systems and they might be uh, people who are putting information in and getting information out. And what those curved lines represent is what that information is. So if we look down at the customers, the customers are putting in their customer information and they're putting in their order. I don't know what an order line means in there, but they're putting in their order and they're getting out an order invoice. Employees will just be putting in information about themselves and their products and categories. And the manager will be putting in information about a new employee and getting back the employee list and the vendor and product information. So it is about who puts what in and what they get back. And this is really useful when you're actually coding. The purpose of these diagrams isn't just to create paperwork. It is so that when you're actually making the system, you're thinking, well, who am I dealing with? What information are they giving them? And what information do I have to give them back? So that's what a context diagram is.